Hey, in this video we will be doing a very light styling of this tree which is already in leaf so I have to be careful but most importantly pinching the growth uh, so the pinching on a large just like any other elongating species is something that we do to remove the auxins from the extensions on the extremities and that will stop inhibiting the growth of internal foliage, internal buds and produce new buds uh, that may be adventitious and they may grow. So we can do this several times during the year. I do it normally twice or perhaps even three times depending on how vigorous the tree is. Now as you can see this tree is not styled so before I know which extensions I want to let keep growing because of the design and which I want to keep from extending I need to style this tree I will not completely style this tree because of the time of the year but I will lower this branch here to where I want it to be may bring some of the branches sideways I have some freedom to to wire carefully closer to the trunk the fact that uh, these extensions are as big as I allow them to be like so allows me to first of all not damage too many of the needles that I want to maintain from the original from this year's growth but also to spend some of the energy of the tree now these larches are very strong and so it's okay to not pinch right when it's starting for example here uh, it's just starting to elongate and it's barely visible on the other hand here or 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 most other places it extended to the to to a level where it's easy to remove it and and I can take some of the energy uh, with it just like with the other uh, species the the pinching is simply a matter of holding and pulling holding and pulling as I twist holding and pulling as I twist so I'm, I'm leaving the needles that I'm leaving there they are untouched not harmed at all and only the new growth is the one that I am uh, removing for example here like so most of the top and all this region here really I don't need any elongation uh, on these lower branches I may need some we will see so here I can simply pinch all of them So I finished styling the tree, I removed two branches, 
two small branches. I could only wire the primary branches. Uh, it's just too difficult with the foliage to to wire everything. But now the tree will start growing in the r with the branching in the right position, and I can start already removing needles and buds that grow underneath and uh, do, do not uh, contribute to the aesthetics. This tree will be let now to grow and I'll be continuing to pinch it now that I know the silhouette that I want um, and it will be fully styled next uh, spring just before bud break now we'll let the tree grow and this is the apex we have uh, this tra more traditional look but in the future I'll probably shorten this side and, and have more of an asymmetry towards that side at the moment we have an apex centered uh, with the with the tree, this is a tree that I bought from someone, and it is full of um, structural flaws that should have been um, dealt with in the past, much earlier in the life of this tree. So for now, I have to leave the tree as it is, but I like it. It has a lot of potential, but it will always have a few flaws. The main flaw here is perhaps this branch here right at the same level as as the defining branch and this is something that will cause ev eventually inverse taper so perhaps one day this branch will have to be removed in the not too far future but for now it's not causing any problems yet so this is it for now um, I hope you took out something from this video and until the next one, bye bye for now.